voice, nothing but text from an unlisted number. What do I care? As long as your money shows up in my bank account. That's the crazy part. <laughs> nicely, I'd have opened it for you. Congratulations are in order. Maybe you're not as stupid as I've been led to believe. Why are you doing this, Enigma? Direct. I like it. So, I'll tell you. Gotham sullied it. It's filled with brutes who control this city through violence and intimidation. You didn't answer my question. Because you didn't let me finish! <clears throat> I want to get rid of them, Batman, to improve Gotham's intellectual and moral standing. But I'm not a thug like you. My approach is a bit more... refined. What you're doing is no different than stealing. There's nothing refined about it. <laughs> Your response is as predictable as it is banal. Goodbye. Now I can access the SIM card I took from that arms dealer and hack Penguin's communications. The Penguin's pretty pissed off about the deal going south. Yeah, if I was involved in that, I'd be on my way out of the city. Alfred, I'm reading a signal from Penguin's men, but it's not associated with any known wireless frequency. Ah, yes, I see it here. Looks like Penguin runs his own private wireless network, using laptop transmitters serving as ad hoc comm stations. He's feeding his men frequencies via two-way radio. There are two of these comm stations near your position. Good. Mark them on my map. If I can find and hack those walkie-talkies, I can triangulate Penguin's position.
find the next comm station. Then I'll be able to triangulate Penguin's position. Let's mess with our shipment. And save his own ass. So next time you want to make up a story, you better hope the person you're telling it to is dumber than you are. Oh, wait. That's right. There ain't no one dumber than you! Mr. Cobblepot, I swear it was the bat. He dropped Ricky off the roof of the clock tower straight into the Christmas tree. I don't care what you think you saw. If you're not back, you'll find money in the next ten minutes. I'll cut your damn eyeballs out. And then you won't have to worry about seeing them ever again. Is that clear? Yes, Mr. Cobblepot. I'm sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. Think about it, man. All year round, ain't no one's guarding these comm stations. Then, all of a sudden, the coldest night of the year, we got the guard. It's some passive-aggressive form of punishment. And the reason we're out here is because all the assassins in town. Assassins? After Penguin? What'd he do? Nah, they're after the bat. Black Mask hired him. But Penguin's worried they might track him down or something like that. Wait a second. Ain't he selling weapons to those guys? Mm. Mm. Listen up. I know I ought to cancel our annual boiler deck fights after what happened tonight at Jezebel Plaza. But just there to show you, you are. what a nice I'm guy I am, the fights are still on. So get yourself down to the ship right now if you want in on this. Penguin's been hiding out on an old ship. No wonder he's been so hard to find. Wait for Lagos. What are we looking for Penguin's got snipers out. If I want to approach unnoticed, I should silently take out these snipers.
You wanna get cut, Batman? Looks like someone brought a bat to a knife fight. Watch my... Ah! <laughs> welcome, welcome to this year's Toilet Deck Fights. You know I always get a lot of money for I want my lawyer. <laughs> well, that and I need someone to clean up the pizza. <laughs> oh, and don't think I didn't notice those of you who didn't bet on yourselves. You're either cheap or lacking confidence. Neither are desirable qualities. Penguins just been tested him out on his own so far. The penguin is hosting some kind of fighting tournament. That's where I need to go. You're all miserable, ain't you? All right, lads. The rest of you losers to be. You're gonna have to embarrass yourselves without us. God knows you can do it. I've got some business to take care of in the office, and I don't want to be disturbed. Tracy will be running the fights till I get back. Sounds like Penguin will be in his office. Tracy should know where that is. I'll make her talk. Then I'm gonna 
to show me where the penguin is. All right, you lousy mugs. Time to earn your supper. Telling you, Jack. A little more pressure and I'll crush your larynx. What's it going to be? All right, all right. Uh, he's in his office. Only way in is through the theater. On the other side of the casino. But you'll never get past Tracy. Tracy is not a problem. That worked better than the last interrogation. 